thinks it's great and he's my second part to my TikTok trend, food slash drinks. If you haven't seen the first one, go check it out. And I'm going to go to Passway to do the coffee. I'm going to make the whipped coffee thing that I keep seeing everywhere. Because I've seen a bunch of videos of people having it. And I just need to try it. For no other reason. I'm also going to make my fiance try it and he hates coffee. So this will be fun and entertaining for everyone. I love that you're annoying that. You're like, mm, yeah. So, there was a few recipes online and I wasn't really sure which one to follow. But the main consensus was two teaspoons of everything. And a lot of them said to use hot water, so I've got my hot water ready. I've also got um, some little tablespoons which have the cutest little designs. Don't, hopefully you can see those. The things we do for a good camera setup. So far in here, I thought a teaspoon of sugar, coffee and some hot water. I've been whisking it for a little bit and it's actually coming on quite well, which I'm surprised about. I think that should be okay, I think. We'll figure that out. Oh no! Okay, so it's a little bit clumpy, so I actually added some more water and it seems to be helping. That's what I'm gonna say is okay. So I've got my milk, got my ice cubes, got my kind of whipped coffee, I don't know. I don't usually drink iced coffee, I'm more of an iced tea kind of person. Nevertheless, I'm excited to see how this goes. I'm gonna stir it first, I'm gonna stir it all in. It smells kind of like a caramel macchiato that I would get from Starbucks, so, it was at this moment that he knew he f up. Okay. It tastes good, but I definitely went wrong somewhere because there's bits of coffee. Just all in that. So I'm going to try this again. And hopefully I can make it actually work this time. Because it does taste good. I have made a big mess with that whisk. That's better. I think my issue was last time is I'm using like the dark roast ones which are a little bit, you know, thicker than regular instant coffee. So my privilege has let me down. Try two. Whew. I'm not going to fill it up as much because I really don't want to waste my soy milk again. <laughs> okay, so I think, yeah, this one hasn't actually got bits on it, <laughs> thankfully. Yeah, it was definitely the fact that the coffee was dark though, so I just needed to do something else for a bit. Try a bit harder. Pro tip for anyone that wants to make it, don't don't use a measuring jug. Definitely don't use a small bowl. Use a mixing bowl because that actually keeps it all nice. Ooh, that's fine. It still smells like a caramel macchiato and I'm so excited. Wow. It it basically tastes like a very milky coffee with a lot of sugar <laughs> which is basically what it is but i really do like this and i probably would make this again it is really satisfying <laughs> now i'm gonna go see if my fiance will actually try this hello do you want to try it i'll try it. oh why is it all around the top i i'm <laughs> Did you spill it? I had a hard time. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna say. No, it's really nice though. 
Well, I heard your comment <laughs> saying that it was like milky coffee <laughs> with a lot of sugar. Yeah, look, pretty much. But it's more milk than it is coffee. Which you probably won't like because it's soya milk. But... <laughs> No. <laughs> no. I don't know. I hope you enjoyed that video and you watched both parts. And if not, that's also fine. You can just watch this one. Um, if you want me to do any more TikTok things, let me know in the comments. I had a lot of fun making these videos and editing them. So I hope you had fun watching them. See you peeps soon. Beach Kate out.